like what do you think led to your success out there tonight? Um, I just um, kind of was attacking the zone. I had two different breaking balls working for me tonight. The changeup was actually, I got some outs on that as well. It was really good. It was kind of tough in the beginning to get feel for the fastball. It just was so cold. It was hard to um, stay on top of the sinker. And I knew that I had... Uh, I knew that I had um, good command of the, the breaking balls, and so that was really the, the key to the success tonight was just being able to command both breaking balls. How, how did you get a feel for your fastball, being the um, conditions were so tough? Yeah, I think the first inning, like, um, you know, as a long guy, you, know, you never know, like, you know, when things start, they unravel, they unravel quick. So it kind of that kind of happened quick for Cole in the, I think it was the second or third or whatever it, inning it was. And so I, I kind of started moving around a little bit, and then it was like, hey, you need to get on the mound and start going. and. So I, I wasn't like, you know, I was warm, but it wasn't like it, once once I got a time to sit down in between innings and then go back out there for the next inning, um, I kind of got f better feel for it. What did it mean for you to be able to contribute in this way tonight? Yeah, I think it, it you know, it, mean, it means the world to me. You know, um, a lot of work has gone into this and to be able to get my first career win here is um, it's a very, very special moment. It's something I don't take lightly. Um, it's just it's a, a big blessing for me and you know a lot of like I said a lot of work has gone into it and you guys have you know you've seen the injuries and stuff like that so be able to come back from that and, and feel as good as I do right now and being able to string together some good outings early on in the season and have some success and hopefully continue to keep that going throughout the season um, is a blessing and so I'm just very thankful to be able to do that tonight. Clark, what is it like to see Miguel Cabrera at the plate? Yeah it was uh, it was it was a special moment to be able to, especially you know he's chasing such a milestone. Um, obviously, I let that first one slip. I told him at second base I didn't mean to hit him. Um, it's just he's such like a prolific character in this in the sport. Um, and I mean, you see the response from the crowd tonight, and, and what he's done for the sport is it's nothing less than amazing. And so um, to be able to get a big strike out there uh, was a special moment for myself. And um, you know it was cool to be able to face him and to be able to have his name on the lineup card for my first career win is, is a special moment for me as well. What did he say back to you? Uh, he's, you know, he, he know him. He's always laughing and, and, and making funny faces and stuff. So he was, he made some funny face to me and, and said, "You're good, no worries." So, I was, I was happy. I didn't hurt him. How was your speech when you got the belt? Uh, it was good. It was. I told, I told Ron. I was like, I'm more nervous. You know, I'm more nervous to do that speech than I was to even pitch. So, um, you know, the pitching is the easy part. That 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 part's a little bit harder. But you know, it was good.